the first Patriots parade, as you said, in 10 years. And we wanted to give you all a little sense of what that parade route looks like at the moment. We are on Boylston Street in the area of the Prue. This is where things are going to start tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock. And then the route will wind up Boylston, a left onto Tremont, and then finishing at City Hall Plaza. So this will cross. The route symbolically the finish line, as did the Red Sox rally back in 2013 after they won the World Series. The major challenge here, as you can see, is cleanup. The snowiest week in Boston history, and it has posed a monumental task for crews out here. You can see the sidewalks. They have done a very good job of getting these cleaned up. But one of the issues that I noticed is that on certain parts of this route, the mounds that have been left from that cleanup on some of the sidewalks, if you just look to your right, for instance, uh, if you're a kid, you know, and you're here to see the Patriots, you might not be able to see over these mounds. Uh, some of them are six, seven, eight feet tall. Uh, that could pose a bit of an issue. And of course, the iciness, because it's going to be so cold tomorrow, they're going to have to make sure they lay plenty of sand and salt along these routes as well to keep uh, folks safe. Uh, at the end of this route, there will not be a rally at City Hall Plaza as there has been in years past, and that is because of that frigid cold. It's going to be brutal, way too long to stay outside through a parade and then a rally, too. Uh, as for the questions of can the duck boats make it through this snow, which they have never had to do before in any of the past rallies, and as for the question of why not hold this on Wednesday instead of tomorrow, Mayor Walsh addressed both of those questions at a noon press conference today. We'll make sure the duck boats get through the snow. We'll have our, we'll probably have plows in front of them, behind them, beside them, next to them, under them. Um, uh, and it, it really comes down to the players. I mean, we lose a lot of players. As every day goes on after tomorrow, you lose more and more players and the opportunity for, for the whole organization to be celebrated by the people of Boston and people of New England. Another look here uh, on Boylston Street along the parade route, which will start at 11 o'clock tomorrow. That's the library to our right, Copley Plaza, just ahead. We're about to finish the marathon or cross the marathon finish line, which the Patriots will do tomorrow on 25 duck boats as they get things kicked off at 11 o'clock and then make their way over to City Hall Plaza. Again, no rally there. You'll have to stand along the parade route if you want to take this all in tomorrow, and I imagine so many people will.